I have to take care of my medical bills, which is huge. It is huge. You have to take injections every month. You have to take pills every month. And the surgical procedures are way too expensive. Every day, even if I'm an actress today, like I will still have these phases. I will go back to night and I will have the same feeling of dysphoria. And it's, it's so hard for me to explain that feeling. As a person, like when were you introduced to this side of yours and you know, how did you come to acceptance and at the same time, you know, while these are internal struggles going on, like how was the treatment that you got from the people around, you know, as a kid? It's just very tough, you know, and it's so hard for me to explain. It's like, it's just like reliving my past again and again. And all I've done throughout till this moment is like forget about my past and just create a new identity. And it's, it has been a quite difficult journey. It's whether it comes to my financial situations, whether it comes to my personal situations, like how I'm feeling every day. It's like very hard for me to explain. And it's like you have to explain to people to be validated. Like, you will not accept me if you're not able to understand me. It's like, it's put me in a situation where I seek validation from people. I seek acceptance from people. And it's, it's really tough. You know, I have to pay my bills. I have to pay my rent. I have to, I have to eat. I have to take care of my medical bills, which is huge. It is huge. You have to take injections every month. You have to take pills every month. And the surgical procedures are way too expensive. You know, when I was young, I thought I'll be able to be, I'll be able to be way further in my medical transitioning. And every time I think about it, it's just really crazy for me to just reflect back and see that no, I am not where I I was supposed to be medically. So it's it's like a every day, even if I'm an actress today, like I will still have these phases. I will go back to night and I will have the same feeling of dysphoria. And it's, it's so hard for me to explain that feeling. So, I mean, I'm glad ki it's still going to shed some light on these things. And I, I, I feel like with my story, there are so many girls like me in villages. You know, I hope they see me and they, they find some strength. That's what brought me strength, you know, mm. to see people like me on screen. And I feel that maybe a example for me, it's the dream for me. Hi, this is Dibakar. You're seeing me talk about LSD2 on Telechakkar. Hello, this is Abhinav Singh and you're uh, watching me talk about LSD2 on Telechakkar. Hi, this is Bonita Rajprahit and you're watching me talk about LSD2 uh, on Telechakkar. Go watch the movie on 19th of April. Hi, this is Paritosh. You're seeing me talk about LSD2 on Telechakkar.